Oh, what's this for you? The reading for the collective. Take what resonates throughout the rest. I hope that you're doing amazing and I really appreciate you. Really appreciate your positive energy, your support of one another. Um, okay, Knight of Cups Reverse. This is very similar energy to the last two reads. There's something about someone love bombing someone here. The last read, there was someone that was, um, I don't know, it felt like they were trying to come back. Five of Swords reverse, Eight of Swords defeated, trapped, or wants to trap someone. Nine of Cups reverse, someone who's not happy, or Ten of Pentacles reverse, someone who didn't get this windfall, or who's lost everything. Ten of Wands reverse is the problem. With the moon reverse, you reap what you sow, seeing through some sort of illusion, very paranoid. Someone's very paranoid. Ten of Wands, they need to release a burden. Ten of Wands reverse. Or there's some type of shame and guilt. Maybe someone got love bombed. Someone was in denial or they don't want someone to see something. Someone's walking away. It's got to do with religion, marriage, work. Someone trying to avoid a tower. And the subconscious. Knight of Pentacles, but it almost feels like it wanted to come out in reverse. It was sideways. I'm going to leave it sideways. There's something about a long-term commitment. High Priestess reverse. Nine of Swords. Some type of fear or paranoia regarding a feminine energy who's real witchy. Or this feminine energy is feeling paranoid. Recent past, Seven of Cups. Someone's trying to figure out their options. It has to do with this love bombing. This someone's very disingenuous. Some, something's being made fair for someone, or someone's paying someone. Ace of Cups, or someone here loves someone, or wants to make something fair, or some something is being made fair. There's like a third party situation here. This could have to do with tradition, marriage, initiation. Someone's defeated. Contentions. Seven of Wands reverse. Either someone or expectations. Someone feels like they're not protected doing something or they feel like they're not going to be able to defend themselves. Judgment reverse. They didn't listen to their better judgment. Some sort of a message. Someone's trapped because of a message. Or someone's going to trap someone with a message. Or someone's trapped because someone's going to message someone. Or this, this information is... Someone is going to communicate something. Three of Pentacles reverse. It has to do with a group of people working together, collaborating together, and something fell apart. Someone here is receiving good news. It's like someone's moving fast and passionately towards someone. But there's a High Priestess reverse here and a King of Wands reverse. that are trying to avoid a tower. 
In the near future, we have this King of Wands reverse looking at this Knight of Cups reverse. And this Knight of Cups reverse is trying to figure out their options. They have been, or they know someone's trying to figure out their options. Someone's sneaking, lying, cheating here. Seven of Swords. Nine of Cups. There could be some sort of um, addictive patterns or, or indulgence going on here. Someone's real paranoid. Someone is really, really nervous and paranoid. They're trying to avoid a tower. Death. Having to do with an ending. Having to do with someone following their passion. Very, very nervous. Someone's real nervous. Nine of Cups reverse. Someone's sneaking and someone's really nervous. The lens someone is looking through. The Empress. Someone's looking right at you. Someone sees you as the Empress. You've overcome some type of sadness. And someone here lost everything with this High Priestess Reverse. Or this High Priestess Reverse was trying to block someone from receiving a Ten of Pentacles. Someone's walking away. Someone's ships aren't coming in and somebody's walking away. Someone loves someone. And there's some sort of an issue with a group of people that were collaborating together. They're all very nervous. They're all real nervous about something. Um, there's a lot of action. Some, someone is making moves. Someone's very disingenuous. And there's a lot of fear. And there's loss. And someone is, is lying, cheating, stealing. Um, and everybody seems to be operating out of their shadow side here. King of Wands reverse, High Priestess reverse. Um, not good intentions in the environment. I feel like someone is trying to save themselves or something like that. They're trying to... Magician. Get themselves out of a, a bad decision, but it feels like something is a plot. Knight of Wands. Something about someone moving towards either someone they're real attracted to, maybe moving away from a situation where their ships aren't coming in. Page of Swords reversed. There's like some sort of slander here. Seven of Swords. Maybe someone participated in some type of slander or someone was stalking someone and it's like they want to get away from the situation and maybe pretend like they weren't part of it. Maybe they're trying to hide what was going on or this is some type of a plan. Seven of Swords. They're sneaking. They're hiding a plan. Someone, someone is either being seen as someone who's a, a master manifester and they want to come towards this person, or there's someone here making moves and trying to make an impression on people in the environment, taking action. Passionate action, some sort of illusion is broken, or some sort of a secret is out that someone was trying to hide. Knight of Swords, someone's moving quickly and courageously. Someone is very bold, someone's moving fast. Someone didn't listen to their better judgment. They didn't get this Ten of Pentacles, or they lost it. There was some sort of underhanded behavior going on. Bad energy, drama, 
behind the scenes with a Queen of Cups reverse and some sort of illusion is broken or there's a lot of lunacy here. This could be happening at work or regarding someone's work. Someone's ships aren't coming in. Someone is not doing well. They've lost their money. They lost access to money. Um, or they didn't get this windfall they thought they were going to get. They didn't listen to their better judgment. Um, hopes and fears. The tower reverse. Someone wants to avoid this tower. They don't want everything to fall apart. Or they don't want there to be some sort of shocking revelation. Or... They don't want something to blow up in their face. They don't want someone to get enraged. They don't want there to be a big drama. Or they don't want to lose everything. They don't... It has to do with some type of lunacy in a group. Everything's falling apart. Seven of Swords, lying, cheating, stealing. Someone was sneaking, they were doing something here. Or they still are. Seven of Swords are trying to avoid a tower. Outcome. Definitely not trustworthy. Queen of Pentacles in the upright. So... Whatever they're trying to do, it's not going to work. Queen of Pentacles, you're in the upright. It feels like this has to do with money and stability and status. If someone's trying to sneak to ruin your reputation or your foundation, it's not going to work. The lovers under the deck. Somebody was doing something underhanded, behind the scenes. There could have been a lot of discord, someone could have been in competition with you. There's something about someone moving towards their passion. This has to do with a choice in love, an agreement, a contract. A negotiation. I don't know if someone's hoping that you're going to overcome, you've overcome some type of heartache and that and they can start again with you. But something here, Knight of Cups reverse. Someone's love bombing someone. There's change here. Someone's a false person, right? Something is changing for a false person or a false person wants to change something here. A love bomber, someone is false. Someone is not trustworthy. Maybe someone's realizing that they got love bombed or someone who is false is planning and plotting. They don't want someone to know, Seven of Swords. Maybe someone's putting someone up to something. This has to do with a house. Or someone's house, someone's home. Someone's stability. Lovers, it has to do with a choice in love, a couple. Someone is false here. Someone's false. Yeah, there's something about a message. Some kind of secret coming out. There's a masculine energy involved that is trying to pretend like they didn't weren't trying to steal something. Um yeah. They could have been involved with 
another person, a feminine energy. Regarding you, your status, your position. There's something where you belong somewhere, or there's something you do. Or you belong, something belongs to you. There, I don't know if someone's coming towards you that has some type of official position. Something to do with a house or someone's leaving a house. You belong somewhere. Something is right for you. This is you. That You're this queen of pentacles. And this main male is not, this is either a family member, a colleague, a friend of an ex. Yeah, they collaborated with another feminine energy. Whoever this main male is, they're not a romantic interest. There could be something. Legal documents, it has something to do with a marriage something formal regarding a marriage and there's something that belongs to you or something that you it's your position and there's a community of people involved I feel like they they know something they could be writing a wrong you don't seem to be concerned or someone didn't want someone to think of you in a certain way or for you to know something or think about something and there is a masculine energy who's not doing well in X. I don't know if they want to send you a message or they got a message. Or they know this message is coming your way. So someone love bombed someone or is love bombing someone. has to do with someone's work or profession, someone losing their profession, someone losing their job, someone's business being destroyed, someone love bombing someone and someone's business being destroyed, or someone love bombing someone, someone was after someone's wealth, this main male was after this was after wealth. This main male wanted this money, or they got offered money, or they were promised money, or they... Someone, someone here is very... This is fake, a fake nice person. Fake nice person after money. It has to do with you. There's something about you and this money. Someone getting in between you and this money. A secret coming out. Or they know something about this money. A house. Someone could have worked really hard to steal something having to do with a house. Break someone up, break two people up, or there's a couple spiraling downwards. There's something about a house or someone's stability here in this main male. knows someone, this money, it's your money, there's something about your money and this masculine energy, I don't know if they're delivering something to you, there's all this money here, there's something about a house, or they were trying to get in the middle, some sort of secrets coming out, I feel like they were trying to keep it to themselves, keep the secret to themselves, it could be something about someone's health, It's if you didn't think about it, if someone didn't think about it, you didn't want someone to think about something. Nine of Cups. Someone who lost their job is very disingenuous or losing, lost their career or their business or that's what someone was trying to do. But you're in the upright here. You're this Queen of Pentacles. 
Something belongs. Yeah, this main male keeps coming out. Sudden wealth. Something about you, this main male, and sudden wealth. And we're looking at someone who is disingenuous. They're showing up in the upright. I don't know if this is someone who's trying to tell you something about this money, or, or this is someone that is was associated with someone trying to steal something, or get rich quick. There's definitely something about you, your money. Someone lost their job, someone was trying to block someone's profession to get rich quick. Or someone tried to ruin someone to get rich quick. Ten of Wands reverse, or somebody tried to come between you and this money, or someone was thinking they were going to get this money, or someone paid someone this money. There's a lot of money here. We, we keep seeing Ten of Pentacles reverse. So there's some sort of windfall. There's money here. And maybe they thought they were, this is involving their profession. Or someone's going to lose their job because of what they've done. Maybe there's some sort of fraud. Or someone tried to set you up because they thought they were going to get some money. Lovers. It has to do with a choice in love. Someone's very disingenuous. Someone could have lost their job. Someone... It's this money. They're looking at this money. This money coming in. They don't want someone to think about it. Ten of Wands reverse. Courtship reverse. Guilt, shame, letting go of a burden, letting go, letting go of an issue, not courting someone, trying to stop someone from courting someone. Someone wasn't expecting something or it has to do with a message, it has to do with a false person. Someone's sending someone a message, someone is false, someone is disingenuous. Maybe you're not expecting something here. It could have to do with someone's health. Someone was trying to steal something and they failed. They failed. I don't know if someone's traveling towards you. Maybe someone doesn't want to go to jail or to get out of a trap. Deep down, Knight of Pentacles. There's something about you. You're very stable. You deserve something here. Yeah. It's like something happening with your status. Like someone trying to get you out of the way, it feels like. Lovers reverse. But someone was wearing a mask here. Someone was not honest. They were wearing a mask. And now they're exposed, and it's like, you deserve something, or something is yours. This is like a leap in status, money. Someone was, yeah, there's some sort of unexpected income coming. There's something about this main male that's involved. Someone isn't able to steal something from you. Someone's on a journey. Someone is heading towards you. There's something about a couple or trying to stop someone from coming towards someone. Something is happening, though, that someone wasn't expecting, and it has to do also with some sort of communication, and I feel like it's... There's something about somebody who is pretending. They're pretending, or they... Someone was wearing a mask, or they are going to try to wear a mask, or someone's realizing someone got love-bombed. Someone didn't get this money. They thought they were going to get this money. Something belongs to you. It's 
the way someone sees you as well. You're the right person for something. You're the right one. Something to do with somebody here that was pretending or lying. Someone was wearing a mask. Lovers reversed. There's some type of like breakup or a couple is involved. Some sort of secret coming out. Deep down, there's something about a Knight of Pentacles, a long-term commitment. That someone's in despair about. This main male keeps coming out. Whoever they are, sudden wealth. Yeah, it has something to do with all of this money. A great fortune being lost or someone trying to take a great fortune or someone not getting this great fortune someone was trying to steal something there they failed they failed someone's a thief someone's a liar someone's sneaky coffin oh someone passed away I don't know if this is an inheritance some sort of secret coming out maybe to do with a family something to do with someone's health Someone could have left someone a gift. Someone didn't want something to change. Someone could have been avoiding something having to do with the legal system. Something could have, I don't know, some sort of evidence or something of what someone was doing around this money to leave you out in the cold it's very disgusting. There's an official person here. I don't know if somebody looked at details. There's something about someone committing to you or someone's hard work. Because there's also something about someone's occupation. I don't know if this is somebody who um, got paid to do something fraudulent with someone's inheritance or if somebody plotted with like a copycat energy to take your money, ruin your business, ruin... It feels like there's money already there. It does feel like there's money there. It feels like they plotted for money. There was some sort of money. And something about getting you out of the way and something coming to light about this money and someone not succeeding at this plot or plan and something was, it, it had to do with you not being aware, you not being aware, you not thinking about something. And there's a, like a feminine energy here that's involved. Yeah, thoughts, some reverse, someone doesn't want someone to think about something. There's a main male and a main female. They don't want someone to think about something. As long as someone doesn't think about something, they're putting a lot of effort into something. Or if someone's working hard, they're not thinking about something. But the secret's coming out. It has to do with someone's health. If someone's not thinking about something, it's almost like... Lying by omission. Seven of Cups in the recent past. What to do? This main female reverse. Trying to create an illusion. Or, or they're trying to figure out their options. Confusion. Illusion. Thoughts reversed. Not thinking about something. Someone doesn't want someone to think about something. But there's a message here. Something about someone communicating something to someone. Yeah, there's definitely a message. Trying to block a message. Courthouse. Block a document. Block you from receiving something. They're trying to figure out their options because they don't want someone to think about it. There's an official person here. There's somebody involved that 
It could be... Somebody who... It's like some sort of bureaucratic or formal position. I feel like the person, either they were doing something routine, fraud was right under their nose, or there's an official person that was involved. I don't know if they got paid. Just so you know if this is for you or not, we have Saturn in Sagittarius, Venus in Scorpio, Mars in Leo, Gemini. Um, that's what we have so far. This could have to do with an inheritance. There's this main male here that is really bothersome. There's something about this person. I don't feel like they're someone you can trust. This is the vibe I get. Seven of Wands reversed. Somebody can't defend themselves. Because there is a couple involved. Or this is a contract or agreement. They weren't expecting this. They're not going to be able to defend themselves. So it feels like they were trying to hide something. It has to do with someone's health. There's a community of people that can, tr can see clearly. They can see something. They can see there's a group of people that can see something about a formality. Or this is like the court of public opinion. Someone's not in bad health. Someone tried to take something from someone. Some something is coming out. There was a secret, maybe in a family. King of Wands reversed. There's a masculine energy here, not trustworthy. It has to do with this message. And they're all, they've been trying to figure out what to do. They've been trying to figure it out. It has to do with this lost fortune, or not getting this fortune. Poverty, somebody, I don't know if someone wanted you out in the cold. Or someone tried to spend someone's fortune or wanted someone out in the cold. Or this person tried to steal something and, and they're going to get left out in the cold. Maybe they were living on something that belongs to you. There's something about a couple spiraling downwards or a breakup. That means someone doesn't get this great fortune. There's poverty. Maybe somebody was trying to get rid of you because they wanted to be with someone that has a lot of money and someone was paying someone to keep someone stuck that has a lot of money with someone here or somebody was living off of someone's inheritance and there's a couple involved could have to do with someone who who's passed or something to do with there's a family or these people had a secret there's a couple there's like a masculine energy that was maybe they're like a um money manager or they they manage wealth manage wealth Or something was passed to you. There could be real estate involved. Someone could be worried they're going to lose everything because you're going to get this message. Or there's an official, there's somebody here who went back and looked through records or somebody, somebody caught on, somebody caught on. Someone's false. They were trying to steal something. It definitely has to do with money. 
definitely has to do with getting you out of the way. Maybe the wealth has to do with a masculine energy that they were trying to distract that has money, resources. Because it, it does feel like the other thing could be that, you know, if you were involved with someone and they wanted to get you out of the picture because this person has a lot of money or they felt like they were going to get farther ahead without you in the picture and they collaborated with this main female to love bomb someone who has money and get rid of you because they felt like they were going to get rich collaborating with this main female and an ex of yours not sure which it is but if there's a family involved I also feel like there could be someone who passed away and left you something it's like somebody didn't include you in some sort of formal proceedings but they weren't able to steal something lovers reverse it's like a couple Great fortune, reverse. Thief, reverse. They didn't get the money. There's something that they thought they were going to hold on to. There's a message, a document. Wealthy man. There is. There's somebody here that has money. Courthouse. There's some sort of legal proceedings. Contract. Formal document. Record. Communication messages something is they weren't expecting something something caught them up the empress you're the empress something is yours you deserve something but you were left out but you maybe it has to do with you not being able to defend yourself coffin someone wanted to end something for you formally Great fortune reverse. There could be an ex involved. Some sort of a breakup or a couple. Maybe there's a lawsuit. Something to do with someone's health. I don't know if someone was trying to say that you can't handle a situation because you are uh, not mentally sound. And it's like they excluded you from some type of proceedings. Um, maybe there was a position as well. Like a position at a company or on a board. Or someone that got caught up in this is going to lose their job because they committed some type of fraud for this family. And it seems like there are so many moving parts here that it's almost like I'm picking up on multiple mu multiple situations but it actually feels like one situation um, like a lot of fraud a lot of there's a uh, battery went out someone's getting exposed here there's a lot of people involved I don't know if someone's gonna have to leave a house yeah, someone's going to have to leave a house. Someone, if there's a masculine energy from your past, break up a couple. I don't know if this is your mental health, a position at work, a position you were supposed to have, a position on a board, an inheritance, a couple involved, and it seems like multiple scenarios because I'm picking up on multiple people in the collective, but it does feel like actually one situation. It feels like a lot of fraud and lies and how it all comes together. Um, there's like, there's like a bureaucrat. There's somebody that, somebody that, I don't know if they knowingly committed fraud or if they went back and looked at their records. There's something about that. There's something about 
some sort of official document or something that has been discovered or there's some kind of formality. I feel like that somebody reviewed or that they can't. Something here and also about your mental health or your phys physical or mental health. I know someone was trying to say you're not capable. Or someone was trying to get you out of the way because they, they, they were going to get money. This was all for money. This is all money motivated. And there's also something about someone not courting you. It's like, it's like you're busy working and you don't know all this is going on. You're busy working. You're focused on build, building something or stability. Meanwhile, there's this money here. And I don't know if someone's losing their job because people are realizing they committed fraud. Someone's love bombing someone here. There's a lot of shame. Someone was trying to stop someone from courting someone. And there's a lot of arrogance too, and so many people involved, they weren't expecting for this to unravel. Even though there's so many moving pieces, for them to keep this big lie going, it's, it has to do with this main male. Someone getting discovered. Someone is false. Someone isn't. Someone was either lying about your health. Someone was trying to take your inheritance. Someone was trying to block you from having a relationship with someone. Someone didn't. Was trying to get you out of the way, ruin your career, get rid of you, defame you, so they could work with this main female. But there is a choice in love, or a contract, or an agreement. And there's just some sort of a formal document here, and it does feel like there's also some sort of inheritance and fa a family involved. Something about someone's health and sudden wealth. A lot of money. Some, something falling in someone's lap. Unexpected. An official person. And a community of people that know something here that are righting a wrong or... It's almost like as long as someone doesn't think about something, coffin having to do with an ending, they feel like they win. If someone doesn't look at the document, if someone doesn't ask questions, if someone doesn't inquire, the Empress, but you're very clearly someone that's upstanding and it's almost like you worked, you created abundance anyway. Um, there was something about someone trying to stop someone from marrying you. A journey, someone went on a journey to block this gift. So someone wouldn't get this great fortune. They don't get the gift, they don't get the fortune. They went on a trip. There's sudden wealth here, there's a lot of money here. But you deserve something or something is yours. Magician in the environment. Someone here is, is manifesting something or somebody is a master manifester. Coffin. Maybe someone didn't think something through. It has to do with this sudden wealth. There's a lot of money here. Something coming out of a house. Someone has to leave a house. Someone's traveling to someone or someone left a house to travel. So, but someone's getting exposed as false. Something is ending. Maybe having to do with someone as long as someone doesn't think about something in the environment, someone's a master manifester, but this community is all aware of something here. Poverty, of leaving you out, leaving you with nothing. But something is over. Someone's trying to avoid a tower, because I feel like this is extreme financial fraud, defamation, 
This is trying to keep you isolated somehow. This is horrible. Tower reverse. They're trying to avoid a tower because they're going to have to give back what they stole or they went through all this plotting and planning and now they're going to be seen as a thief. You know, something didn't work. This, this could be shame. Tower reverse. They don't want someone to get this message or to think about something. It has to do with a wealthy man. Someone doesn't want you to get this document. There's a whole community that knows something connected to this wealthy man. Maybe something's online or digital. Someone did something very disrespectful. A masculine energy from your past could be involved. You deserve something. Something is, you didn't get this gift. Something has been gifted to you or you have a gift that someone was trying to stop or block. It's almost like someone was jealous. Someone was jealous. health reverse you're not in bad health or something you do with this wealthy man wasn't in bad health someone did something very disrespectful dishonorable lovers reverse a couple or to keep two people apart someone's lost someone's respect or someone is not in bad health to keep two people apart or this is a couple it has to do with the masculine energy that I feel like there's a lot of money. Maybe this is someone, a community leader, or there's a bunch of people that know something about this masculine energy. They don't want you to get the document, the proof, the proof of something. There's some type of detail that's missing that it's like these people were counting on people missing this detail or and someone is false someone is lying but it's like they're exposed um i feel like it does have to do with your capabilities as well and there's something there there is jealousy that was motivating someone um it isn't just greed um queen of pentacles you, this is something that was supposed to be yours, but you're already a queen of pentacles anyway. It's like you worked towards something, established your, your own stability in spite of some type of defamation or lies. Change reverse. So, so okay, so that means that they've been trying to block something from happening here regarding your money. Gift reverse. Your money, your stability, your respect, your position. Something's coming out. Something that was just between a few people. It has to do with leaving you with nothing. So you wouldn't get this gift. But it's, it's all coming out. And these people might have to start over. Especially if they were living off of something that's yours. They didn't want someone to see you and in a positive light. There's something about your respectability. You're this privileged lady. It's definitely feeling like they didn't want you to have this money. They didn't want people to see you or someone to see you as someone that can handle something here. It's like all of these people got in the way of something that's clearly yours. It's like you're I don't know if this is an inheritance, a position, or both. And what's interesting about it is that you're not in poverty. Yeah. So there was some malice here. Someone just wanted to see you grovel. There's some sort of jealousy. They wanted to see you have a hard time. Someone wanted to see you have a hard time, but I feel like you did have a hard time, but you 
even through the hard time you maintained there's like you, you've very dignified even through some type of you know fraud or this horrible corruption and you it's very clear you know it's kind of like an analogy is like you know Cinderella <laughs> it's the, the best I can come up with right now Cinderella you know is very kind to the stepsisters and then you know when she's cleaning the castle She's on the floor with a bucket and she's singing with the birds and she still has a lot of respect and she sees the glass half full and she maintains her, her integrity and she doesn't get bitter. And it's like, you can see very clearly, it's not the clothes that make someone this privileged lady. It's not um, the, the social status. It's not the position is like emanating through your pores, this grace, this grace that comes through you. So I feel like that, that has been making somebody angry because I feel like someone wanted you out in the cold and I feel like there were people here just, you know, it feels like vultures ravishing, you know, wanting to live off of something that's yours. And, you know, it's something about a house or also, you know, wanting to be seen and all of that, but it's like still coming across as like the opposite of you. Um, someone was definitely trying to block your pathway. The battery went out. Someone was trying to block something from being gifted to you spiritual gift, birthright, inheritance, um, your, your, your dignity, something that you're very good at, you being able to self-actualize, your reputation, but it's like you've been so polite or so graceful and then you've worked on something anyway. It's almost like everything they did, um, that's where I feel like this shame is. There's shame here. There's shame. That's, someone wasn't expecting something. I do feel like that there's something about this wealthy man. I don't know who they are to you. This is someone who left an inheritance. There's like a whole family that... is involved. And there's a couple and there's an ex. Knight of Cups, reverse occupation, reverse. Something was very unjust. There could have been some sort of fraud, le legal fraud, but you persevered anyway. That's, there's irony. There's a lot of irony here. Because I feel like these people feel like the, what is that song? It's not the clothes that make the man. You know, they, they feel like if they can just take this stuff from you in this position, they can be above or better than you, or they can feel great about themselves. Yeah, there's some sort of evidence coming up and out here. And it's connected to your perseverance, though. Someone didn't want someone to think of something. Yeah. You're not going to love yourself more because you have these things. Especially if you stole something from someone. It's like... Someone clearly doesn't love themselves. some sort of guilt or shame here. Yeah, you. there's something to do with you gaining. 
and you you being very you operating in a very independent way avoiding conflict you don't fall prey to Fast track for someone here wearing a mask concerning money or trying to hold on to money wearing a mask it has to do with money and there's something about a house or big money or big project real estate someone's job someone's occupation Someone here is a love bomber. Because I feel like there's still a plot here as well. Something about you not being lonely. Someone not being blind to something here. Good news. Inspiration. And there's definitely stalker energy. Very manipulative people here watching some sort of karma, karma play out having to do with somebody trying to steal something from you. It's like people know there are people who have been watching this happen. It's like creating all kinds of obstacles for you. What if this has to do with someone passing on? Someone stealing something from someone. Definitely, there's definitely thievery here. Whether it's your trying to stop you from self-actualizing, your hope, an inheritance, a connection, a job, a business, an idea, a gift, stop you from using your gifts. This could be like a whole family, like you're very talented at something and try to hold on to you. Like, um, say you're in bad health, you're in, you're not in good health when you're perfectly capable and, you know, keep your assets and doing it in front of everybody and using the court for it. There could be that or left you out of a loop completely and you don't even know this is going on. There's definitely something about a family. There's definitely a couple involved. And I feel like there are people like, people on the outskirts, there's other people benefiting from this. And there's so many people that it's very arrogant that they thought that this was gonna keep going. And I do feel like there's somebody living in someone's house. It doesn't belong to them. I feel like there's potentially somebody here that left you a position or something to do with your job or your 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 capabilities I'm trying to say you can't do something you're not capable and something to do with your your um your mental health and i am 100 percent picking up on an inheritance that somebody left to someone that a whole family has been like trying to skim off the top or hide something Something also could have happened to somebody. Somebody didn't pass away naturally. Um, that could be, you know, somebody's aunt. Somebody's aunt did something here. This could be someone's uncle that passed away and left something. Um, this could be someone's father. It's like a lot of greed and I feel like people who are jealous of you because I feel like along the way these people have felt like you had some sort of gift or talent and you know they they didn't apply themselves this way uh, and they just wanted to, to feel the feeling that they feel like it must feel like to be you when you have these achievements by stealing your money or stopping you so that they could feel the feeling that it must feel like to be you.
feeling like they're going to love themselves more if they, you know, can drink the best wine and live in the nicest house and and hide hide it all from you. And there's like some type of like financial advisor or some type of accountant or attorney involved in more than one. I feel like there's like a lot of people skimming off the top or trying to. So I could be picking up on more than one scenario in the collective. So definitely take what resonates. But in a lot of ways, it's feeling like the whole picture. And it's giving Cinderella vibes. And there's irony here because you're stable or you built something in spite of what they've done. And it's there's some sort of narrative about your mental health. It's very clear that not only do you deserve the reason why someone left you something or the reason why you had this job or this business is because you apply yourself because and also because of your you're respectful towards people. You find the light in everyone you um, maybe to you feel like now even maybe to your detriment that you, you know, you see people's soul. Or you give, give people too much credit or you feel maybe you, that's a long time ago. I feel like you, you're, you, you put yourself first in terms of your stability and you've learned a lot. There's something about someone caring for you there could be a parent or some, something about someone supporting you. Someone's in stress stress mode over this. There's some sort of karm playing out. It has to do with a family. You're a sweetheart. There's something about your character. You being very independent, practicing self-care. Because I feel like they wanted you just out in the cold. This, these people are nasty. They wanted you to feel like... Um, I don't know. It feels like they they could they could care less if you ended up out on the street with nothing, because they get to gain. They get to get to say, "See, you're not any good." See, I knew it the whole time. You 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 know that was just luck, or uh, you're you're not worthy, or uh, who cares about your good heart, or it's some sort of jealousy of like your your good nature your politeness, your, it's all, it's all, you've been that way since you were a child. I feel like these people have been jealous since you've, there's been jealousy in a family around you since you were a child. Someone wants to compromise. There is someone here. There's definitely someone wearing a mask and they're wearing a mask around this money. Someone is wearing a mask because of this money or for this money. Some sort of luxury that that's just the third time it's come out. Something about someone being a false, more than the third time, a false person. And there's some sort of paranoia they're going through. Guilt, shame, guilt and shame. This um, marriage reverse is clarifying courtship reverse. It's something about someone not marrying someone. Someone dreaming about these ideas having to do with money, a treasure, taking someone's money, a treasure, stealing someone's money or doing something just for money, stop not marrying someone, um, dreaming about money, stealing someone's money, someone's stealing, someone's false here. And you got yourself out of a trap. It's almost like someone... You've been feeling like there's been like a lot of stalkery energy. People overly concerned with the details of your life or what you're doing. It has to do also with your ideas and something that originates with you. It's like... They did all of this. And it's like you're not even focused on all this nasty behavior. And you're still building something. So there's some type of like, 
self-disgust that is just under the surface with these people. Because if they've stolen something and you don't even know about it, you have a sense of lightness of being about you and you're building something anyway. I feel like it's driving someone mad. There, there's some sort of self-disgust. If there's an ex here that fell for something or they went into agreement with something, I feel like there's an ex. Somebody, somebody fell for something having to do with money, an ex. There's some sort of guilt and shame connected to it. There's definitely, it feels like people conspired to take money that belongs to you. I do feel that. There's some sort of money here and it feels like a lot of people all living off of it. Um, deep down there's something about a long-term commitment, someone being in despair over a long-term commitment. If there's something about a choice and love that's really big here as well. I mean, actually, that's the biggest part of this whole read. Something about a marriage, a courtship, a commitment, a choice in love, and, and money. Um, yeah, exactly. Money. Worth. Extravagance. Something about someone not being able to... Someone not falling for temptation. Someone's in despair that maybe they shouldn't have fallen for temptation or it has to do with someone making you a promise, being responsible, confirmation, assurance. Some, it's something to do with a commitment, commitment versus money. Someone wants to apologize. So I feel like there's an ex here that did something for money. They could be losing their job or they were willing to um, do anything for this money and somehow they uh, threw you to the wolves and they got involved in a situation that was all about, um, you know, breaking you down and blocking you from um, self-actualizing or this has to do with destroying your business or getting you fired. Someone's false here. And there's something about you being very practical, putting one foot in front of the other with self-love. In spite of some sort of, there is, there's a smear campaign attached to this as well. Someone trying to figure out what to do, this main female is. is not sick somebody's not injured so someone doesn't get the treasure that means karma is playing out someone's trying to figure out what to do they're trying to hide evidence of something somebody's not sick which goes back to this thing of like somebody trying to say you're not mentally sound Someone is not sick. I mean, if this is also some type of thing, you know, people that believe in energy harvesting and all that type of stuff, like they were trying to get you sick, benefit off of your demise. Or this has to do with an inheritance and someone trying to say you're sick. So you can't handle or try to convince people that you're unstable so that you can't work. You know, oh, he or she is crazy. Spread rumors. But there's something about the way you've handled yourself. You're this Empress energy that's coming through loud and clear. That you're, you're not sick. And you're not worried. If someone was trying to... Um, make you feel paranoid, 
So someone wanted you to exhibit signs of, you know, instability so that they could point the finger and say, see, um, you know, you, you shouldn't have loved that person or they don't deserve the inheritance or they sh don't deserve to work or we should take their money um, or they, sh they shouldn't, shouldn't get, get any support or someone shouldn't marry this person. Um, it has to do with going against you. It definitely has to do with going against you. I feel like there's definitely a shift in the change here. There is a third wheel involved that's very um, voyeuristic, stalker energy. Stalking someone's money, looking at someone's money. They see you're not worried. Even though no one helped you, no one helped you. Someone to try to stop someone from helping you with your career, your profession, your job. There's something about someone trying to get rid of you in your, your career as well. So they try to steal money, stop you, block you, ruin your reputation, and say you're in bad health, and also try to block any, any means, any means of, of income. Yeah. They didn't want anyone to respect you, but you're very clearly this privileged lady and it doesn't have to do with how much money you have. It's a, it's something that's been inside of you. It's, it's, it's your dignity, but dignity has to do with respecting others as well. It doesn't mean that you're always perfect. It just means that your default, um, you know, is, is that of a leader, that someone that can see, see, you know, you have empathy for others. Um, not to say that all, you know, there, there are leaders that can be horrific. So that's not what I'm saying, but the leaders that you admire, you have the qualities of leadership, leadership that people admire. And there's hard work, there's honesty, there's empathy, there's diligence, there's respect, there's respectability. There's, there's kindness, there's tranquility, there's peace, there's manners, there's ethics. They're treating people, treating people from all backgrounds and walks of life with respect, seeing people's light, applying yourself, taking care of yourself, um, practicing self-care, self-love in spite of all of this. And so it, it, it actually, it highlights those characteristics about you even more. Um, someone wasn't expecting something here. There's something to do with a the message. They can't um, defend themselves. They weren't expecting something. There's some, for some reason, they're not going to be able to keep going. Um, it has to do with trying to block your gift so that you lose your job. If something originates with you, someone could lose their job for trying to block your gift, block you from receiving a gift. Some sort of strategy failed. Something that's meant to be for you just is. Someone's really stalkery here. And they can't relax. They're watching something. They're watching and waiting for something. It has to do with the collaboration and money. Someone's real disturbed about your fate. Something unfolding for you in a positive way. Someone was definitely trying to block you from receiving a gift or using your gift. Message of concern in the near future, connected to a King of Wands reverse. Someone receiving a, a message, something about you. Not being injured, you being, receiving a reward, good fortune, jackpot. Something that's faded for you. You maintaining something. There's, there is, 
trust compatibility. There is something positive, some sort of a message of concern in the near future. It's connected to something that originates with you, your vitality, your creativity, even without any help. Or someone trying to block you from receiving help. Something's not over for you. You can't be manipulated. You win. Success, achievement. You're focused on success and achievement. There could be an alliance here of people working to help you. You're not haunted. You keep learning. Every time someone puts these, tries to put these blocks in front of you, you keep developing. Good news, someone could be going behind bars as well. That was part of a collaboration to bully you. If it's not actual bars, they're stuck or trapped somehow, maybe energetically. Wow, you're an empress energy. There's something about someone trying to block you from getting married or mar someone from marrying you with this ripe energy. These people could dibble dabble in lower vibrational spiritual practices. It has something to do with money. I don't know if someone paid someone money to do something here. They're not okay. They don't want someone to help you. There's some sort of karma playing out. You have good luck, fortune, reward around you. They're very disturbed by this. That they didn't get merit instead of you. Again, it goes back to wanting to squash you to experience the, the rewards that you worked for so they can feel like they're on top. That's literally what's driving these people because money is just the means to pay for that feeling, but they're not getting it. If anything, this is embarrassing. They're, they're not okay. Um, and they're stalking, they're stalking. They're watching you with the self-love, practicing self-love, self-care, receiving good news. Magician, someone sees you as a master manifester or there's a master manifester here causing an ending to the situation. Even though someone didn't help you, you're still, you're still, um, inspired, you have a vision, there could be an alliance of people around you. Um, or some sort of karma playing out. There's definitely someone here that clearly doesn't want to stop. It has to do with blocking your career, your profession, in exchange for some type of an adventure. They're a thief in the environment, looking at you manifest in spite of what they've done. There's some sort of promise around you here. You're not angry. There seems to be a group of people maybe even helping you win. Or you're collaborating with people. Um, someone's overloaded by this. Someone doesn't have the same gift that you have. Or they were trying to block you from receiving a gift or utilizing your gift. Not to say that this person doesn't have some sort of potential in their life, but this is way, they, they went way off track. Way off track. So far off track that it's coming across as if they, they're not gifted in, in, in at anything. Because there is anything coming up about, about them besides trickery and thievery and stalking and lying and being false and trying to get ahead and being money hungry trying to get ahead at someone else's expense, being 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 evil minded. Um, if they these people have something that they're good at, they cert they certainly haven't been concentrating on it. They're worried about some you receiving some type of a message. They don't want someone to reach out to you. They don't want people to see this message. Cause something is gonna be ego-crushing, having to do with someone not only bullying you, but being found out for bullying you, the reasons why they were bullying you, and that they also failed. 
So it's that's why it's ego crushing. They were trying to steal something, some sort of bully trying to steal something from you. This person can't relax. They're, they're worried about some kind of details of something coming out here. Justice. There could be a, a big lawsuit. It has to do, there's luck on your side here, jackpot, fortune, reward, which also makes me feel like there was some sort of money here. Almost like someone wants to apologize with this letter, trying to steal something from you with a group of people who all thought something was real funny to bully you. I feel like it's just gone on for so long and you're not injured, you're not angry and you're building something regardless. You're still focused. And every day that goes by, it just looks more and more, um, just low vibrational. I also feel like there were people here who were trying to knock you off your square to do what you do instead of you that aren't capable of doing what you do instead of you. But they want to have the feeling of being respected and, um, you know, they want the accolades, but they didn't work for something and they're not, they're trying to stop you from doing something you're skilled at, um, so that they can receive accolades and money, um, but they're not good at, at it. I feel like there's something about that coming out. And again, it's not to say that they're not good at something that they could be, you know, that they could receive accolades for, but it's there. That's what they're misguided. They're, they're misguided. They, they want to, what you do, not what they do. So it's just, you know, see, see, watching you, I feel like there was something that you, you got some attention here at work. I feel like this has to do with work. There's definitely romance, some type of relationship here. There's jealousy. There's people operating in the background to take something from you by bullying you. I feel like there's an ex that wants to apologize. They, 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 they were seeing everything. Uh, they, they allowed this group that was jealous, that didn't have something to offer, um, except for jealousy, bullying, thievery, because they, but they were, they're good at acting as if, but they didn't actually have the skill in this area, not to say they don't have some, you know, fabulous qualities. I feel like at this point now, they have a lot of karma to deal with. They should have focused on cultivating the things that they're great at instead of stealing and bullying. Um, so, but this isn't about, about that. There's somebody here though that wants to apologize because you do have a lot of dignity and you do, you, you are, you are balanced and you are capable and, um, you are kind hearted and you, you've moved forward in spite of what these people are doing. I feel like someone's losing their job or something like that. Someone here doesn't want to quit doing something or they didn't quit. But now though, there's still someone here in this stalker mode, real stubborn. This is someone who is trying to tell people what to do. This is like a know-it-all that's still trying to stop you. It has to do with feeling like they're going to gain something, but pe people see something about you. This is some type of thievery. Someone does not want to end something here. There's someone here that feels like they're still um, going to gain something. Trying to block your, your job, your career, your business. I feel like it's this, this main female and that main male. Like there's someone here that wants to, they're worried about this message. If they're trying to steal something from you now, it's not going to work. Queen of Pentacles, you're in the upright, 
Um, you're not going to change how you feel about yourself, how much effort you put in. You're still building. You're not going to become bitter and angry. You're not going to lose your, your um, you know, stability, your emotional stability. They're not going to be able to trigger you into some sort of a spiral. Um, yeah, outcome, good news for you. More good news for you. You can't, you can't be manipulated. Um, you're focused on managing, you're focused on your schedule, not, you know. Okay, so this is some type of plan to block a blessing having to do with something that originates with you. I feel like also there could be someone trying to steal something based off of like something that originates with you. It's uniquely yours that you've put a lot of effort into patience and it's like stealing that from you after you you worked really hard you know on something there's something about that as well some sort of plan um just a really nasty group of people um so let's see sort of final thoughts on this situation there's definitely a king of pentacles reverse involved seeing that you self you self love you you practice self love and it's just there's abundance connected to it somebody here is definitely trying to lie cheat and steal um, someone would do anything to get ahead someone's in competition with you it's like someone in competition trying to steal something from you instead of focusing on what they do they're looking to steal what you have. There is a King of Pentacles in the upright around you. And the stealing, lying, cheating, stealing is getting exposed. Um, there's still someone here trying to criticize you. Um, that's real... I feel like... It, because it has to do with someone's commitment towards you. Or you being very committed to your career, your job, your business feels like you have an optimistic attitude and you're focused on work. Um, someone's very disillusioned here. I feel like this is someone that participated with these people. Um, someone made a mistake. I feel like someone might want to message you. I don't know. What, what is this they're, they're not expecting to happen? They're, they weren't expecting something. Being stuck somehow. Being stuck. So this person, something about you receiving an offer, your potential, someone being greedy, very greedy about this offer, receiving some type of bad news. Maybe they got, tried to get in the way of something that someone was giving you, and it's like it's appearing anyway. There's some sort of news or information about this. Someone here is still out to win at all costs trying to do something underhanded behind the scenes. But there's still a King of Pentacles in the upright, and it's something about your strength, your willpower, that's very important here, but this Queen of Pentacles reverse is, is receiving bad news. There's something about that that they can't defend themselves regarding some sort of injustice. They could lose their job. If this person has some sort of position of authority um, and was abusing their power, there could be something about that where they they are losing their job. They could be trying to love bomb someone here and they're a bully um, that's very jealous of you. That could be what's coming out. There are high priestess reverse energy. This person could be very witchy, um, want reward without effort, be very materialistic, money and power hungry. And it could be all coming out, getting exposed. Someone here that's attached to them feels really remorseful really remorseful. This can end up with a lot of chaos around their their finances because getting exposed, being attached to this situation, you know, they're culpable. Yeah. And they could, if they were getting paid somehow, someone was getting paid to participate in something here. Something is much too much of a burden. There could be some type of evidence coming out. It's connected to a king of pentacles. Maybe you already know about this collaboration or there's a collaboration here uh, to help you or to, to collaborate with you. 
There's definitely someone walking away from a situation. Something's very petty. Someone could be losing their job because they've been spending all this time trying to attack someone else then cultivate what they're good at. Someone here is just all about love bombing um, that is extremely jealous, very, very toxic. There's, there is a King of Swords reverse involved as well um, that is very dark and manipulative that's focused on you in this situation, but you're handling something in a really beautiful way. You're transmuting this energy. You've definitely got Earth Angel energy, and it's like it's exposing this whole situation, um, and they can't defend themselves. Yeah, people are seeing through an illusion. There's a King of Wands reverse involved as well. It seems like something's coming your way. It's something about an offer, potential. Yeah, some type of a blessing here. Um, and someone's real burdened by it. Someone's really burdened that they got love bombed or that, that there's like a player energy or someone is doesn't care who they burn that's feeling like they're falling from, from, you know, something's not spiritually aligned, something is lackluster, something feels really base and corrupt and like low level criminal. They feel like, you know, doing all of this negative projections at a Queen of Cups. It's just really base, connected to a Queen of Pentacles reverse. They really can't defend themselves and there's a bunch of bad news coming. We'll leave it there for now. If you resonate, I hope that it helps. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.